Hey guys, welcome to another video. Uh, before I start, I'd just like to mention that I will actually be going away for uh, tomorrow night. So, obviously today, if you're watching this, when it's been uploaded, 7th of March, Wednesday 7th of March, I'll be going away tomorrow night, so the night of the 8th of March, for... The third for the, the sorry the Thursday night Friday Saturday Sunday and they'll be back on the Monday. So what's going to be happening is I'm going to be doing two um, previews today. So that takes care of Wednesdays and Thursdays. Tomorrow before I go I'll be doing also two which will take care of uh, Friday and Saturday. And then when I get back on Monday I'll be doing another two that will take care of Sunday and the Monday, then I'll be back on track. So as I said, today I'll be, I'll be doing two previews, team previews, uh, Collingwood and Essendon. So starting up with Collingwood, uh, coached by Nathan Buckley, captained by Scott Pendlebury. Um, at $26 for the flag, it's unlike the... Um, Previous couple of days of those teams not going to happen. It could happen with Collingwood. I still wouldn't put my money on, but um, it certainly is a possibility. So starting with the ins, they've got um, a, uh, one trade and then some draft picks. The trade is Sam Murray from the Swans coming over. I don't know who he is, but... Um, they obviously picked him up for a reason, so he must be playing some good footy. Um, and the drafts are Jaden Stephenson, Nathan Murphy, and Tyler Brown in the actual draft. And then in the rookie draft, Flynn Appleby and Brody Miacek. Miacek, sorry. Um, the outs, quite a few outs, a couple of quite big ones. Uh, Jesse White has announced his retirement as has Ben Sinclair, and also Lachlan Keefe, Henry Shade, Liam Mackey, Mitch McCarthy, Jackson, and Jackson Ramsey, sorry, have been delisted, so they obviously will not be playing for the Pies next year. Um, they have promoted one rookie who has played a bit, who has played a bit of footy for them, and that is back, and that is Mason Cox. The big man is a decent player, decent um he's from America, so he's definitely taking well to the sport and hope he does well for the Pies this year. Um some injury concerns. They have quite a few. All of these players should be back for round one, but you know, you never know. So these are uh Jamie Elliott. Levi Greenwood, Alex Fasolo, Darcy Moore, Jeremy Howe, Daniel Wells, and Tom Phillips. So, as I said, with various injuries, all these players should be okay for round one, but yes, you never know, so they probably will play, but you never know. Um, round one, they actually have my boys, my boys, the Hawks. Um, it's a bit hard we played them twice last year, one win, one loss. So, you know, you just never know. Round one, you can't exactly, for most games, you can't really pick who's going to win. So, Collingwood might win, Hawthorne might win. I'm just not too sure. Obviously, I'd love the Hawks to win. That'd be great to beat the Pies. But, um, yeah, I'm just not too sure. So, um, yeah, I think that's everything with Collingwood. And moving on to the next of my previews, a bit of a short preview there, but moving on to the next one is the Bombers, coached by John Worsfold and captained by Dyson Heppel. Um, of quite a few big outs, which makes me think that they will be going down, as I said in a video a few days ago. Um, I mean, on my first video, in fact, with Adelaide, I think Essendon will be going down um, for the outs that they have, but I'll cover the ins first. Luke Lavender, who was a Category B rookie, 
is he will be in the team now. Devin Smith from GWS, Adam Saad from Gold Coast, and a huge pickup, Jake Stringer from the Bulldogs, which is fantastic for the for the Bombers. He's a brilliant player. The package, um, he really is the package. Um, definitely would love him at Hawthorne. Um, three other pickups. Jordan Houlihan in the draft, Brandon Zerk Thatcher in the draft, and Matt Guelphy also in the draft. Um, and also they've got a promoted rookie, Jake Long, who hopefully he's, he's obviously impressed and they're going to give him a go, so good on him. Um, moving on to the outs, uh, quite a few retirements and delistings. Uh, Yeston Eads retired, um, James Kelly retired, Brent Stanton retired, and also Joe Watson, all massive hits, apart from Eads, but Kelly, Stanton, and Watson especially are absolutely huge outs, and I just think that the impact that uh, that that'll have the whole, that, uh, that they'll leave in the um in the makeup of the team is just too huge i think for them to really have a good tilt this year they are at $14.50 so um shorter odds than Collingwood has said but um yeah 14.50 i still don't think it's going to happen so but you know it might so with you know equalization this year uh, i mean the last few years sorry we've we've had Surprise, uh, premiers. I guess with the Bulldogs in twenty sixteen and and Richmond last year. Who knows? It could be Essendon this year. You just don't know. So um, as I said, the promoted rookie Jake Long. Moving on to their injuries, they've got three players who will be out for an extended period. Travis Collier has a foot injury. I uh, will be out for ten to twelve weeks. Uh, Jaden Laverde has an injury. Uh, I'm not too. I can't really tell you which, what kind of injury that is because I've to fucked that up. Um, but he will be out for eight to ten weeks. And Aaron Francis has, um, some mental illness. So he is out until further notice. Something that I know a bit about, but um, yeah. So my thoughts are with Aaron Francis getting through his. Stage. Um, round one, they have Adelaide, who will be winning, I'm pretty sure. So Essen will start the season 0-1. Obviously, as I said, Adelaide will start 1-0, so Essen have to start 0-1. Um, yeah, not too much to say. I, I think, I mean, I did say Adelaide will be going down, but I think they'll be still quite strong. And, um, yeah too strong for Essendon for for round one but obviously as I said before you just never know with round one so anything can happen um all right so that's the um previews of the of the pies and the bombers and uh, tomorrow's video will be Fremantle and Geelong and then Monday's video will be Hawthorne. No, no well, sorry, it'll be Gold Coast and, and GWS. And then I'll be back on track for Tuesday, Hawthorne, and so on. So thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And, um, yeah, thanks, guys.